Lovely to see you. This is my marvellous Makermobile. I've come out for a drive. I wonder what we're going to see today. Whoa! Toki here. Mini, make a message. Hello, I'm Phoebe. Hello, Phoebe. Can I help you today? Yes, please, Mr Maker. I'll be right with you. must be the place. <laughs> Hello Phoebe, so how can I help you today? Can you show me how to make a really colourful pattern? A colourful pattern, eh? Well, to think up a colourful pattern, we first need to do the colourful pattern dance. Uh -huh. Wait a minute, I know, hang on. <laughs> Coloured wool. This is just giving me a great idea. Let's try something. Try making something really colourful by winding brightly coloured wool into a fantastic pattern. Let's make it! But first, we need somewhere to make it. <laughs> and we'll also need some things from the doodle drawers. We'll be back soon, Phoebe. <laughs> Some sticky tape and a glue stick. We also need some card from a cardboard box. And I might need some help finding that. <laughs> oh, Scraps, you must have heard me. Oh, thank you, but this box is a little bit too small, I'm afraid. What I'm really looking for is some cardboard from a big cardboard box. Do you think you'd be able to find that for us? Oh, great. Here you go. That's it. Go on. Oh, that's more like it. Well done. Thank you, Scraps. That's just what I was looking for. And we also need some more coloured wool. So then, Phoebe, this is what we're going to make today. It's a wonderful woolly pattern. <laughs> Get it? Wonderful. Because it's wonderful and we're going to be winding. <laughs> anyway, are you ready? Yeah. Great. Are you ready? Brilliant. Let's get making. Now, the first thing we're going to do is cover our card in glue. Now, you can help me with this, Phoebe. Here's the card. Grab the glue stick and get gluing, because we're going to colour it in with some coloured paper. Thank you, Phoebe. Good job. And now, stick any colour of paper you like on top. Now, when the glue is dry, we can start to cut little shapes of the letter V into the edges of the card. Now, this is a bit tricky, so it's a good idea to ask an adult to help you. Now, make sure that you make these cuts into each edge of the card. You can make as many as you want and put them wherever you like. But be careful though, because scissors are... Sharp! That's right! OK, we need our wool now, Phoebe. So which colour shall we choose, do you think? Blue, please. Blue! OK, here's some nice blue wool. And we're going to place one end of the wool into one of our cuts here. And then if we turn the card over like that, we can stick it in place with some sticky tape. 
And now, if we turn the card over again, we can start winding. And the idea is to wind the wool from one V-shape to the next until you build up a pattern. Keep winding around the card until you're happy with how it looks. Now we have to stick it down with some sticky tape. So turn it over and stick the end of the wool down. Now, another colour of wool, please, Phoebe. What do you think? Which colour should we use? Green. Green? OK, then can you pass me the green wool? Wonderful. If you use another colour of wool on top, your pattern will look even better. Yeah. <laughs> Before you start, stick down the end of the new wool. So here we go again. We're winding across the card. And the good thing about this idea is that you can wind the wool in whatever pattern you like. <laughs> We're almost finished, Phoebe, but first we need to put some sticky tape on the back. Can you do that for me? Make sure it's all stuck in place. Well done. <laughs> Brilliant. Let's have a look, shall we? I think we are finished. Well done, that is great. And if you enjoy that, here are some other ideas you could try. This windy pattern is made of thick and thin coloured wool. But you could even make a star-shaped one using two pieces of square card stuck together like this. Wonderful winding woolly patterns. Why don't you try one today? So then, Phoebe, what do you think? Very good, Mr Maker. We made it! And now your home is where the art is. High five! <laughs> what a fantastic windy wool pattern. Well done, Phoebe. Bye! <sighs> I love being out and about in the Makermobile. The sun is shining, the birds are tweeting, and... Uh... <laughs> What's that noise? <laughs> oh! It's the shapes! <laughs> I am a shape. I am a shape. I am a circle. I am a triangle. What are the rectangles making today? Can you guess? Any ideas yet? It's a crocodile! Well done, shapes! It's time to get back in the doodle drawers! <laughs> Oh, I love driving the Makermobile. There are always so many interesting things to see. Yay! Yeah. Ah. Minute time! Hey, it's Minute Main time! I'm on my way! I'm here! It's Minute Maid time, everyone! Yeah! And today we're going to make something brilliant. But before we do, I'm going to water my favourite pot plant. Oh no, look at it! Oh dear, that's a bit of a shame. Do you know what I need? I need a plant that doesn't need any watering. Like this torn paper plant. Now you can make one of these in a minute. And you will need... Some sheets of coloured paper. 
a small flower pot, a ball of modelling clay, and that's it! Do you think it's possible to make this torn paper plant in just one minute? No way! Well, I think I can. I'm going to have to be very quick. But don't worry, I'll remind you how to do it at the end. Are you ready? Yeah! Yeah? Are you ready? <laughs> Great! Let's make it in a minute! Three, two, one! Start the clock! Right, we get our ball of modelling clay and we push it into our pot like that, and then put it to one side. Then we get our three pieces of paper and we're going to start tearing strips all the way down like this. But we're not going to tear quite to the bottom till about there. That'll be good. And let's tear out another piece. Here, all the way down. These are going to be the curly leaves on our plant. That's another one down here. Tear that. And one to go, I think. That looked really nice. A nice leaf here as well. Very wavy and very curly. Now, we fold this round into a tube shape, like that. And we're going to stick it into our pot, like that. In it goes. And if I do a bit of gardening, like this, I've got myself a torn paper plant. Yay! Phew, I made it. But if you've got more than a minute, there are lots of other ideas you could try. How about this one with brightly coloured paper flowers? Or how about making one with paper cake cases for eyes? Or you could even make a really big torn paper plant with lots of leaves and a tropical flower. Torn paper plant, why don't you have a go? Here's a reminder of how to do it. Let's go back to the beginning and take another look. Push the modelling clay into the bottom of a plant pot. Tear leaves into the green paper, but don't go all the way to the edge. Roll it into a tube shape. Push it into the plant pot and your torn paper plant is finished. Why don't you try and make it in a minute? Goodbye, everyone! Bye! Now, where to next? Hello, Mr Maker. Oh, nice to see you. Look what we're making today. What are they going to make? <laughs> I am black. I am orange. I am black. Everyone, see you soon. Now watch this. Hello, are you ready for a big surprise? <laughs> These mini makers have no idea what their surprise is going to be or what we're going to make. Hello! <laughs> Hello! Oh, it's great to meet you. Now, do you all like cars? Yeah! Great! Me too! <laughs> that was great fun! And it's given me a big idea! I think we should make a big car! Will you help me? Oh, fantastic! All right then, Mirko, Khalil, Nazra, Hamdi and Hamda, let's make it! Right, we're going to make a big car. What do you find on a car, Mirko? Steering wheel, a gear and brakes and mirrors. Brilliant! Steering wheel, brakes, mirrors. Now I think we should paint our car a really bright colour. What colour do you think? Purple. Blue. Blue? Yellow. 
Yellow. Red. Red? So I think we should paint our car red. red. Ah, what a good idea. <laughs> Do you know what? I think we're ready to make our car, aren't we? Yeah! <laughs> Come on then, let's make it. We can use boxes to make the shape of our car. There's a lot of things to paint. What are we painting? Well, we're painting some hedges, a terrific tree and a hill. <laughs> we're having great fun making our big car. So why don't you try making a little one at home? Try making a brilliant little box car. Make it, play with it, have fun with it. To make one, you will need an empty tissue box, coloured paper, black paper, plastic lids, a glue stick, white paper, stickers and a black pen. First, take some coloured paper and wrap it around an empty tissue box. And tape it into place. Now take a black rectangle of paper and fold the edge up like this. Turn the paper over and then fold it back again. Keep going until you reach the end of the paper. If you find this difficult, ask an adult to help you. Now glue this to the end of the box. And stick a white paper rectangle in front of it. Next, glue a long strip of black paper around the bottom edge of the box. Then tape a clear plastic lid onto the front of the box for a windscreen, like this. Now use four round lids for the wheels and stick them on both sides of the car. Add more details using stickers scrap paper and a black pen and when you're happy with your car you can play with it what a lovely way to make a little car why don't you give it a go <laughs> now how are we getting on here great, great. good would you like some help yeah <laughs> okay Come on, everybody, let's make the grass. Let's get the tubes up. Come on, onto the car. <laughs> we did it! Hooray! <laughs> Nearly finished. There we go. Well done, everyone. We made it! Yeah! What a lovely day for a drive! Mr Maker! Time to go! That's it for now. My making time's over, but yours is just beginning. It's time to put the Makermobile back in its box! <laughs> If you like making things, visit bbc.co.uk slash cbbs.